Hey guys, so like I mentioned in the patch notes video, the Queen's Wrath is back and available today are four bounties. I'm going to very quickly show you guys some possible spawn locations of these targets. I believe each target has a couple of different spawn locations, so I'm just going to show you guys the ones that I managed to find. The spawn notification will show on your screen as a pack of wolves is prowling, so from there just look for a dropship of enemies. In the Forgotten Shore, my team found the spawn by the cave on the right side of the area if you're entering from the moth yards. After you kill Drevis or Drevis, the chest will be near the big ship next to a big crate, which will give a rare or legendary engram and some planetary materials. In the Skywatch, the event spawned near the building that leads you to the Warmind story mission up on the hill. You'll get some waves of enemies, then the Servitor. The chest is located on the opposite side of the area, near the transition from the Moth Yards to the Skywatch next to a fence. In the Ember Caves, Beltric basically spawned right in the middle of the area. When you kill Beltric in this spawn location, closer to the Citadel, the chest is located on the road to said Citadel, which is opposite of where you come into the Ember Cave if you came from the patrol area spawn location. It's pretty close by to where he spawns. In the Citadel, one Picus spawn is right at the entrance of the actual Citadel itself, right next to the two Praetorian Minotaurs. The chest for this spawn location is located on the opposite side of that Vex Spire Pylon thing from the Eye of the Gate Lord story mission. That, that's the only way I can describe it, just look at the video. Those are your spawn locations and chest locations for the first four bounties, keep in mind there are multiple spawn locations for these guys, but just look out for that message, a pack of wolves is prowling, and you can pretty much take it from there. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.